Hello, I'm Dr. Todd Janak here at Mountain Door Family Chiropractic, and in this short video, we wanted to discriminate or try to figure out what kind of headache are you having? And a lot of people aren't sure if they're having a migraine or is it a bad tension headache. There's also a thing called cluster headaches and sinus headaches. Those are the most common, right? Tension, sinus, migraine, and cluster. So to figure out if you have a migraine headache, these are some of the most common things. It is not an exhaustive list by any means. But I want to kind of quickly go through these with you because if you're having migraines, often you know they can be excruciating, uh, debilitating, and really interrupt your life and quality of life. You know, missing out on family events, uh, missing work, things of that nature will really keep you uh, trapped at home or in bed. So let's kind of go through that really quickly. Um, number one, the pain is typically one-sided, and it's usually a pulsating or throbbing type pain and oftentimes it'll be behind one eye. So it's typically one-sided, can be both, most of the time one-sided and a lot of eye pain, all right? Physical activity will tend to either bring on a migraine or make one worse if you feel one coming on. Um, so there's also migraines with an aura, okay? And that's when you start seeing, um, well, they call it an aura, little lights or scintillating lights and flashes and things like that as well, but not all migraines have that. So that's a migraine without an aura. Um, definitely sensitive to light and noise. Bright lights, loud noises are going to be very uh, aggravating and provocative to a migraine headache. Um, Over-the-counter medications typically have, have little effect, especially if you're already having a migraine. Sometimes there's over-the-counter migraine medications can uh, hedge it if you feel one coming on or you're getting an aura. Um, it can kind of slow down or stop it from starting. Of course, there are also um, prescription medications, right? Neurotech, um, uh, Imitrex, and Maltox, things like that. Um, but again, most people don't like to have to take medication because they all have side effects. So, um, but those things can help. Um, and then rest and sleep, all right? That is typically, if you're having a migraine, most sufferers, nothing really helps until they lay down in a dark and quiet room and just sleep it off, um, which can be hours, and some people it's, it's a full day, so it just wipes out their whole day. Um, and sadly, headaches are the number six cause of disability worldwide, so one in four houses we drive by are chronic headaches and migraines. So this is how to differentiate if you have a migraine. Uh, if, you've, if you're concerned or you're not sure, um, obviously seek your doctor or we're happy to help as well. If you'd like a consultation, we can help you figure it out. Um, hopefully that helps. We have other videos too about how do you take care of a migraine, what are things you can do at home, and how can we help specifically with upper cervical chiropractic care. So thanks for listening. Um, if you have any questions, again, give us a call and look forward to talking to you.